To start, smooth on a foundation primer with a makeup sponge. Although there's some debate about whether these colorless creams are really necessary on a daily basis, they're worth it for special occasions. They smooth over pores so that you can start with a perfect canvas. Plus, they give your foundation something to stick to so it'll stay put throughout the day. Now let's begin concealing. For the most natural finish, apply your concealer before your foundation. After you hide your pimples and skin discolorations, make sure to blend a bit of cream around the sides of your nose where even if you don't have broken capillaries, you often get unflattering shadows. Next, we'll move on to foundation. For a smooth finish, nothing beats spray foundation. It mists on an even mask of color that's completely free of brush or finger strokes and makes pores much less noticeable. Start spraying about 6 inches from your face in an S shape. You should go slow enough that you make sure every bit of skin gets makeup, but not so fast that it piles on in any spot. This process should take between 7 and 10 seconds. Check out your brows and hairline. If you got some of the spray on them, wipe it away with a clean Q-tip. Set the makeup you just applied with a translucent loose powder. Then take a clean velour puff and graze over your entire face lightly in a circular motion to help your makeup sink into your pores and remove any excess so that your finish looks very natural.